Girl, these are so good. Hey girl, welcome to this week's weekly vlog. My name is Jasmine and this is your first time here on my channel. Welcome, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below so you can join our beautiful, amazing family here. So today, I just actually wrapped up another weekly day in the life. I just finished filming um, my, fall war my fall collective haul. So I have all this stuff in front of me that I need to clean and put away. Yeah, it was a fun video. I also showed you guys my new handbag again in this video. Um, speaking of, I actually have a quick unboxing to do in this vlog of another bag that I got. Um, I got another purse. Um, I have a shoe on my desk. <laughs> this is just crazy. So let me show you guys what I got. So it's from, I got it at Bergdorf. From Bergdorf. Go in. Let me do it like this. Inside the box, you see the name and then they have the receipts and it's from Fendi. So I'll show you guys here. Oh, they wrapped it really well. So this is the dust bag. And then I'll show you guys the purse. Let me just put the camera back. I just wanted to show you all the inside of the box because it looks so pretty. So yeah, this is the so this is the bag here. Um so this is her. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, her. So I got a little bucket bag. I've never had such a cute bucket bag in my life. It's so cute. Um, it does come with an extra strap to make if you wanted to wear it um, as a cross. It does come with a crossbody strap as well, so you can wear this as a crossbody right here. And it's basically like a nude color. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. So this is it here, you guys. This is the inside. On the side, it has a lot of detailing. I really love that about this particular style. It has so much details. Um, let me take out these things so you guys can see the little, um, the little logo right here. See the look, it has the logo right here. And then it has this gold ring right here. And then on the other side, it's the same thing. I think it just has so much detail and it's just such a beautiful little bag. So yesterday I pretty much cleaned my entire house. Um, so everything is pretty clean. I do need to tackle my closet. That is a big project. So I've been kind of avoiding it. So, but I definitely need to do it eventually. And uh, I do need to clean this area because I made a big mess when I was filming that video. So I need to clean this area so it doesn't stay messy. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna bring, bring these, I'm gonna bring these into the closet. These, um, I'll bring my jewelry. All right, y'all, so I put this shelf like this, but I think I'm gonna switch it up a little bit. Um, what is going on with this bag? Why is it doing this, girl? What is going on? It's sad. It is so sad that I no longer use it on the regular. It's like crying. Maybe I should bring the beige with the other pages, you know, like. So let's see, that kind of looks cute. I'm gonna bring this stuff to the bathroom because that's where they belong. And then I'm gonna be back. All right, so I ended up putting all the stuff in the bathroom. I still have my ruler. <laughs> I feel like a teacher. This is where I keep my sunglasses. I think I've showed you guys this before, but this is where I keep my sunglasses. So anyways, I need to organize my perfumes a little bit because they are looking a little not the way I like them to look. So, um, yeah. Question, tell me what you think about me. I buy my own diamonds and I buy my own rings. Only ring your celly when I'm feeling lonely. When it's all over, please get up and leave. Question, tell me how you feel. So this is my newly organized perfume. Um, I think I like it. I think it looks fine like this. I'm like studying it to make sure it's what I want, you know. You know what? I think I'm gonna speak a switch. I'm gonna bring something else. I'm gonna bring this down here because I think it's like a little bit too much color going on up there, down here. I'm gonna bring this up here. In case you were wondering, yes, 
I am a serial overthinker. All right, y'all, that just took way longer than it needed to. I also put my bum bag in there so you guys can see like what that looks like with the bum bag. This is what it looks like right now. And I do want to get um, some, I do want to get these uh, diffusers to put in here. I had a diffuser in here last year and it smells so good. So I want to get a nice fall one to put in. So I'm going to put that in, probably like stick it in right there for now. Um, once I get it so I want to get that so this camera actually has its own tripod where you can control it with the tripod and stuff but that tripod that it came with is so short that it just doesn't work ever for me like it's just too short it, it's, it's just way too short I don't really ever use it so I have my stuff so I could I to get my um my memory card out of here it's only 11 o'clock. I'm so happy I filmed that video because now I can wear my perfume and uh, that green Zara jacket. Oh, I cannot wait to wear that. I don't know where I'm going with it. Kind of I'm thinking of getting a white Walford bodysuit to wear with that jacket. That's what I'm thinking right now. So it's been like an hour, I think. Um, I just finished editing that video. I also ordered the bodysuit in white. I got the other version of it that I kind of wanted anyway, but I wanted the other one first, if that makes sense. But anyways, I got a bodysuit from Walford in white, so I cannot wait to wear that with my green blazer. This one, I got it to wear with this blazer. I don't know where I'm going, but I'm getting this outfit, okay? So it is 12.50, I am a little hungry. I had my coffee, I haven't had anything else to eat yet. So I'm gonna go to the kitchen and see what I can find to eat, because I'm hungry. Um, my computer is making so much noise, Ooh. And then also I need to edit the vlog for this weekend because I'm gonna be out. We're gonna be away for the weekend, so, well really just tomorrow mainly. So I need to do that, and I need to pack. The kids are gonna be so surprised and so excited. They did go to Legoland last weekend, but they don't know they're going this weekend again. Like, they're gonna be like, what? Also, they had such a blast there that they're gonna be super excited. And also, they are staying over at the hotel and they have no clue. Like, it's just gonna be so fun. Also, wanted to show you guys in here, um, this is my skincare cabinet originally, but I'm transitioning it into a self-care cabinet. And this is something I'm working on, so, I basically decluttered a lot of the skincare that was in here and I'm organizing the shelves differently so the top shelf is all skincare and I'm basically limited it I'm doing this because I don't use as much skincare as that I had in here um, the second shelf I kind of have body stuff on so I have like lotion I have body glitter thingy I have um, body oil eventually I'm gonna put hair stuff here I do have to clean this area but I'm gonna put hair things in here so yeah I'm gonna have a snack first y'all y'all if you go to Trader Joe's you need this so I showed you all this in my last vlog I did a haul the Trader Joe's maple um, fall stuff girl these are so good I can't like I literally cannot I need to go back and get another bag or maybe I shouldn't because it's way too good I have been trying to control myself because it smells it tastes so good right now I am uploading this video to YouTube that I just filmed I am actually doing the description box or well, the title and description box part finished that video that I was working on I finished the description box everything right now I'm about to pack um, a little bag for the kids so I picked everything out this is the dress I'm gonna wear for dinner 
I found it hidden in my closet. I wore this for Thanksgiving last year um, at home and I haven't worn it since. So it's from Zara from last year. I'm gonna wear this bralette with it. It's the same color as the dress, pretty much. Um, and then I picked out this outfit for um, Sunday um, for brunch and then our departure, I guess. So it's the turtleneck from, or mock turtleneck from Boohoo, this bralette. And then I'm gonna wear these TNA leggings with it. These are from Maritzia. And then over here, I have this Madewell t-shirt. Um, and I'm gonna wear my Lululemon Alliance in this khaki green color. I have my skims dress. I have a bra for this outfit. I have some underwear and um, socks and then a washcloth. This is for my face. And then I have my little purse to wear with this bag, with this dress. So over here, I have my kids' stuff. I pack their stuff all in my bag, so that way I don't have to bring as many bags. Um, so yeah, let's see if that's going to work. Hey guys, happy Saturday. My seatbelt. Say. What does that say? Our ye year room B monster free matey. This is the little. This room is so cute. Wow, little octopus on the wall. I'm in the room. <gasps> this is your room. Yeah. Whoa. Where's my room? You were just in it. Yeah. That's your bunker. Oh. There's so cool. Yeah. Pirate come in here. This is the park in the Hudson Valley. Thanks, boy. Oh. You know what to do. We are in our room. It looks so nice. It's so like well put together. The theme is on point. Even the soaps and conditioner and stuff. That's so cool. Little Lego so far. Let me show y'all the tripod that I just made because let me show y'all. It's an architect, y'all. It's an architect. Okay, it's the Empire State Building. So we're getting ready for dinner. Um, we're just gonna go to the restaurant at the hotel. I'm gonna just touch up my makeup from earlier. I'm not gonna really do too much, you know, in terms of makeup. <laughs> Just mix a couple perfumes. I'm gonna mix these two perfumes. All right, so that's pretty much the look. Um, yeah. Ground, because I'm pretty full. Right. So, 
we just left the hotel like 10 minutes ago and we stopped at the outlets in Woodbury. It's like 10 minutes from um, Legoland. So I'm back home. We stopped at the outlets. I didn't really vlog much while we were there. My hair is not looking the best. But um, I, the kids got some new shoes. Johnny got some shoes. I did stop at Aritzia. So I'll show you guys what I got from Aritzia. I have seen this top before and I always thought it was really nice. Um, but yeah, so I decided to pick it up. This is what it looks like. It's like a X top here. And I just thought it was really, really nice. It was at the outlets, but it was regular price. It wasn't like, um, like on sale or anything. With certain stores at the outlets, there's not really that much that's like on sale. Like a Ritzia, most of it is like regular price stuff. And then there are certain stores where I feel like they have things in the outlets that they don't have at the regular store. Like, like I don't know. Good morning, you guys. Today is um, Monday. It's actually 11.20, so it's still morning. I'm getting ready to film a video. I'm going to be filming um, a PCOS update, Q&A, uh, kind of get ready with me. So I'm going to answer questions today. I actually got a package from Salon Perfect the other day. Actually, yesterday when I got home is when I saw it. And I saw some lashes that I really wanted to use today in there. I think it was not wait, was it these it may have been these i really wanted to try out oh these are good too Ooh, they have so many they have really nice styles they have this style they have this style this looks nice too it's like more natural they have these they have these ones and then these are the ones i think i thought i wanted to use today so yeah, I think I'm gonna use those. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh my gosh, so this is Laura Mercier's caviar steak and cocoa. I just got done filming my first video, which was basically my Q&A, get ready with me about PCOS. Um, it took quite a long to film. Me doing my makeup while talking um, about specific, me doing my make and me doing my makeup while talking about specific questions is just a longer process in general. I did have another video in mind to film, but I am literally, starving and i'm also kind of exhausted <laughs> from all that talking i'm gonna do the other video tomorrow or yeah probably tomorrow because i just it's i am out of i am out of words i'm gonna make some uh bread gluten-free bagel stuff from trader joe's all right y'all let's try this Mmm. Pretty good. Yeah. So I finally am leaving the house. I made my iced coffee. Tastes delicious. Let me just put in, let me just go into GPS and see. Hopefully there's no traffic because that's the only thing that would make this trip longer than it needs to be. I'm going to Woodbury. Um, Outlets, I don't know if I mentioned that. So we made it. It is 2.40. Head out and just walk around and see if I find what I'm looking for. All right, so I just finished. I'm heading to the car. I got everything that I went in for. I actually went to a couple other stores that I didn't plan to go to, but I didn't see anything that I wanted, so. I left. <laughs> I did get my Lululemon sweater. Color was so cute, I could not pass it up, and the markdown was crazy. I got Lois trying to get out of the mall, the Woodbury thing, because the, they made like a new exit or whatever. I haven't been here, I mean, I went yesterday, but prior to that, I haven't been in um, the outlets in like a couple years. I guess they like renovated the exit area, so I was so confused. 
guys some home i'm going to show you guys what i got from lululemon and then aritzia so from lululemon i wanted to pick up the zip up jacket like i said so they have this beautiful color um it's like kind of fall because it has that camo and it's a nice mauve pinkish color i really really love it this is the front normally retails for 120 something and i got it for 40 dollars because they had it for 59 then they had an extra percent off no they had it for 49 then they had an extra 15 percent off that and then from a bit yeah <laughs> i picked up this top that i have been also eyeing for a minute and basically it's also from the brand Bubaton, and that's the same brand that made the top i showed you guys yesterday so i got this one shoulder um crop so that's what i got and i cannot wait to wear this this is so easy to style so is the other one but yeah i cannot wait to wear these and um yeah so that's my little mini haul hey guys so i'm in the car with Callie. we're about to go to the supermarket to just get our um groceries for like school and stuff so that's what we're about to do so this is everything that we picked up we actually picked up quite a few things because it was like a, a school haul kind of cereal uh cheez -Its, unicorn mac and cheese for cali uh little little baby pretzels veggie chips bomb chicka but they had the salted maple so i figured i would try this to see if it tastes similar to the trader joe's uh, maple um kettle corn because i really really love that one it was so good um fish fillets for clay we got some the giorno sweet lauren's vegan gluten-free cookie uh cookie dough dinosaur nuggets these bars are like good snacks um got some goldfish blueberries turkey breast um i got a pack of sushi i don't know if it's gonna taste good but yeah i got that these for clay um got some gluten-free raisin bread some chicken i'm gonna have this today for dinner with pasta with some gluten-free pasta and gluten-free spaghetti i'm gonna have this with one of the trader joe's pumpkin sauces and i'll let you guys know how it tastes got some walnuts dry, dried cranberries and coconut shavings um ketchup vegetable broth ginger snap cookies regular raisin bread um croissants pasta um chickpea pasta um got some non-dairy almond and oat milk pumpkin spice creamer from starbucks brand these little bites blueberry muffins that Callie convinced me to get <laughs> um i got some gluten-free pancake mix so i'm gonna try to make some pancakes um i got some made good bars these are really good i got some enlightened bars as well these are hopefully really good these are really good if you want to just have plantains because i love plantains so got these mac and cheese these grips are so good you guys we were eating these they were so good i got some gogurts and some of these kali loves these and i love them too but she really really loves these so we got two boxes and we got some mark Wahlberg burgers so these are really good um yeah so that's everything I'm good morning it is tuesday i'm getting um i'm leaving the house for work i'm just putting some of this sunscreen on my face Good morning, I'll be right with you. Sure, thanks. Hi, can I have a grande iced um, brown sugar oat milk chicken espresso? What's the drink again? The brown sugar oat milk chicken espresso. Oh, sorry, I have the brown sugar right now for my drink. Do you like anything else? Um, can you make it with toffee? I'm sorry? Can you make it with the toffee, sir? Uh, what, what type of toffee again? Can you make it with the toffee syrup? 
Uh, so if you don't see your yeah, but I don't have to write them, so. Oh. Let's go. Okay, um, I'm in the Oh, we do. Oh, never mind. We have the drink for you. Uh, Anything else? Uh, that's it. Alright, see you at the window. Thanks, bye. Sir. <laughs> what the hell? Who is that? Sorry about that. That's okay, thanks. You want a straw? Sure, thanks. Thank you. Thank you, you too. Why did the barista tell me he didn't have the drink? So, I was like, why don't you just make it with the Tofina? Because someone else had made it for me before when they didn't have the brown sugar with, at a different Starbucks. They made it with Tofina. Well, they asked me and I was like, oh yeah, let's do that. And it tasted not the same, but it was good. Um, so he's like, he said, oh, we don't have the milk either. So he says, oh, we don't have the, the right milk. So I'm like, do you not have the milk and the to and the brown sugar syrup? Or is it just not the, like, y'all have nothing? Maybe they were out yesterday and he didn't know they had restocked. Who knows? But we got the drink here. Something is different. Yeah. I'm gonna put on a little bit of concealer today because um, I just feel a little tired. I was so anxious last night. Not anxious, but like um, just, I guess, excited. I hit 49K. Thank you guys so much. I hit it yesterday and I just was so excited. I guess I couldn't sleep. <laughs> um eventually i got out of bed and i went to go take my melatonin because i hadn't taken it um i don't always take it i try to take it on days where i feel like i'm gonna have a hard time falling asleep um and yesterday i didn't think that was gonna happen it was just that i um i was so excited i was just like oh my gosh um but yeah thank you guys so much it means the world it's just so so crazy to me like wow um but you know like those big milestones like 50k is just incredible it's incredible and that is literally what's next and i'm just like oh my gosh i can't believe it so um i am really excited for that i actually i'm i actually need to order some boxes um yeah i need to order some boxes on amazon for that um i am so excited you guys wow hey you guys so i just got done with work um back in the car and i'm about to head home all right so i just made i just finished making dinner and i'm about to eat so i made some salmon and some gluten-free pasta with the trader joe's pumpkin sauce it tastes amazing i had it last night it tastes so good this wash is on and it's really loud so sorry about that but that's what i'm doing and i'm also working on uploading a video right now so go check it out good morning you guys today is wednesday oh it's really cold in this morning who is she oh my god y'all this is when you know. This is when you know it's cold outside because I never get hot drinks, but it is freezing and there's no way I can drink an iced drink right now. I don't know if I told you guys what I got, but I ended up getting a oat milk latte for my um, coffee this morning. Hey girl, so I just got off of work. I stopped at Chopped and I got a Caesar salad because I was starving. So I'm about to eat this real quick. I'm about to eat because, you know. I also got this drink and I don't really like it, but it's like a green tea, honey green tea. It doesn't taste the best. I don't know. And I don't know why I decided to get that either because my stomach was hurting and green tea always makes my stomach hurt. So that was just dumb. <laughs> like, I'm about to go take a little browse at Ulta. I got two things at Ulta. I'm going to show you guys what I got though. I got a bottle of sleep gummies from Sugar Bear here. 
and I definitely live by melatonin at this point. <laughs> so mine is almost done, so I figured I would try theirs. And then I also picked up a Chanel lip gloss. So this is one of the Chanel Rouge glosses, and this Ulta here has Chanel, so I was like, I'm gonna get one of these. And I got this color here. It's called Burnt Sugar. Honestly, I feel like I have this color. I'm gonna have to check. Well, even if I have it, it's really old and I would be due for a new one anyway, but I'll show you guys this color. Yeah, they have so much. I also smelled the new Ariana Grande. Ooh. Let me just put this camera over here. I also smelled the, um, why do I have this mask on my face? <laughs> one second, y'all. This is not cute, but I also smelled the new Ariana Grande perfume she has a cloud intense and it smells really good it smells like the, the first one but more strong but i just left to work and i'm heading um i actually have to stop at sephora so i'm gonna head to sephora and i'm also thinking about um going to home goods because i really wanted to see if there was anything for fall that i liked i haven't really done any fall decor and i don't usually do much I feel like the only thing I really decorate for is like Christmas. I love Christmas. I just stopped at, well not just, but I stopped at Starbucks and I got, I ordered a grande, but he gave me a venti. Um, I basically ordered a brown sugar shaken espresso, but I got it with toffee instead, toffee nut, because they were out of the brown sugar syrup. Um, doesn't taste the same, but it tastes pretty good. I also stopped at Mom's as basically an organic supermarket. Um, so I picked up some little things for the house. I've also been listening to this podcast um, while well, listening to a different one earlier, which is pretty good from the Skinny Confidential. I, I've mentioned that, that podcast to you guys before. I listen to it um, quite often. And then I also got into this one from one of their podcasts. It's called Wellness Mama. This episode is about hormones and stuff like that in women. And um, I really like wellness related podcasts. Like that's usually what I'm listening to. I am on my way to um anyways I'm on my way to home goods and then I'm gonna stop at Sephora I was just talking to myself for like five minutes because my camera was not recording all right y'all so I'm home I'm just gonna show you guys the groceries that I picked up first they are from mom's this is the organic market that's the name of it some pop chips i love these they're really good turkey bacon this is um organic uncured turkey bacon then i got some rice this is um a indian kind of rice it has turmeric and cumin in there so i got this then we got some okay hear me out y'all the hardest thing for me to give up in dairy is cheese so i figured yeah the hardest thing to give up is cheese, so I figured I would try some vegan cheese. I don't know if I'm going to like this. I'm a very picky eater, so I'm really mm, not sure, but I'm going to try this on some fake Parmesan chicken. So I got these. also got some tea. I got some soothing caramel bedtime tea. You guys know I'm really working on my nighttime bedtime sleep routine. Some Italian bread crumbs for my parmesan chicken and these are gluten free by the way um this is the unreal bars i've shown you guys these before but these are like a fake candy i also got some vegan cream cheese picked up some raspberry passion perfect energy tea this is like a focus and energizing tea so i got that then i got i forgot i got these these are a good um pops these are just popsicle sticks made out of real fruit and this one is a strawberry lemonade kind Super boring, but I got some organic chicken breast. Some kombucha. I got this kind. I love this kombucha from Bear's Fruit. Another one of that flavor. Clearly, I like that flavor. Also got the pineapple mint, which I really like as well. Lastly, I got some oat milk barista blend. All right, so let's see what I got from Home Goods, y'all. First, I got this basket. This is the basket here. This is the brand 
um, Artisan Deluxe and it was 17 bucks. How big it is on the inside. Then I picked up this and I just really love this piece. I thought it was so perfect. It actually matches this um, lace back hair. So don't mind my dead flowers. This one is 20 bucks. This is what it looks like, really pretty. Same thing on both sides. And this is part of their Vietnam collection. Got these two frames and they look so pretty. These are so pretty and they have like a plush, like velour piece right here. I think this is so cute. Um, I got two different sizes as well. That's what I got from Home Goods, and I think everything is so cute. I don't know why they give me this big old box for this little um, package. Let's see how it came wrapped up. I think this one came more nicely wrapped than the other one, and I'm pretty sure I ordered it from Wilfred as well. I think maybe I ordered it from somewhere else. I don't know. But yeah, this is. <gasps> Wait a minute. This is like stained. Oh my gosh. No way. What in the world? How did this happen? Should I, what am I? Oh my gosh, y'all. I'm gonna have to go to the store. And oh my gosh, this is so annoying. It's probably was sitting for way too long in the box because what the heck? All right, y'all. I'm going to try to go to the dry cleaner and see if they can take it out. I went to the cleaners. They said they cannot take it out. She said yellow is yellow. We cannot take that out. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, no, girl. Oh, no. This is just ridiculous. Ridiculous. All right. I'm going to return it. I'm going to just return it. All right, y'all. So I've been doing my closet since I've been home and I wanted to show you guys because I put the basket up here and this is what it looks like right now. I definitely like it. Um, yeah, and then I need to go through my clothes and just kind of put uh, summer stuff away. I need to get a bin because I never really do that bin thing. I never really switch out my closet, but I think I'm going to do it this year just to keep me organize and just keep things in order so yeah i'm gonna some of these i'm gonna put in the bin for winter especially like this is definitely a summer top um this bright summery top and i need to find a diffuser for in here because last year i had a really beautiful one and um yeah i need to find i need to get a diffuser and i think i'm gonna look for an led light like a strip light so i can put here to illuminate my perfumes so let me go to amazon real quick <laughs> let me go to amazon's right now to see if i can find one of those